Jen Cravasi, Jekyll Bates. It's been a minute. I've missed you guys. I hope that you guys have been doing all right. You've been getting outside fishing. I was gone for a while, and I think I fished like two hours of the 12 days that I was gone. Lots of cool stuff has been happening in my world. I can't wait to share all of that with you guys. Um, but let's get back to the basics. So um, where was I? I was in Virginia and then in Maryland. I do that every year for family, but this time... I had a swim bait event that I had to go to. It's Wayne Campbell and Chad and everybody that it's over at Swim Bait Universe. You can find them on Facebook. They put on the second annual gathering, which is really cool. Got to meet some awesome bait makers, awesome artists, super fun stuff. I am going to reserve at the very end of this video. I'm going to show you some time lapse of the Bullshed um, booth, which is where I was working at. I am, I guess I can officially say that I am a member of the Bullshed family now. Uh, full-time painting uh, still doing the website thing so lots is happening lots is going on we're gonna get into that probably in a dedicated video for that later down the road um, but I was at this event there is some really cool footage that I have for you guys that I've edited so we're gonna do some time-lapse stuff at the end of the video and then um, D did some live D Chen did some live Facebooking from over there so I've got a little clip of that to show you as well but in the meantime, here's what's happening for the next couple of weeks, um, scheduling-wise, for this YouTube channel. I am going to be doing three back-to-back-to-back kind of touch-up, brush-up uh, spray sessions and tips and tricks for you guys just to get us back into it. Uh, also want to get in some tutorials on like some more in-depth stuff, a little bit of the layering that I do, some of the stencils that I've been using like super hardcore these days. So I'm excited about this winter. I'm hoping to get some fishing videos in, although I haven't really been all that successful fishing. Not that I haven't. When I've gone fishing, I've been successful, but I just I haven't had the chance to get out of the shop. So for me to get out of the shop and spend some time with my family on the East Coast, I've got family there, I've got family here in Arkansas. We're kind of scattered through the states, which is kind of how I've lived my life. Um, not necessarily a nomad, but... Um, I, you know, I'd be up for maybe one more move. Maybe. I don't know. What do you guys think? I know I've outgrown this studio. That's for sure. Um, dedicated videos coming. So in the meantime, I've got some baits over behind my shoulder here. Right there. That I want to show you. And let's get into that. It's good to see you guys. Your smiling faces. I just have a few pieces here this morning and these are do-overs because the post office has lost more mail joy and rapture um, I mean it's just there's four or five packages that are just missing of mine so if you are one of those folks um, Calvin Hopkins I repainted four of these for you last night because the ones that I sent on the first or it was either September 30th or the first like the day I left are still floating around in the black hole of postal service. Um, that is also true of Mr. Goldman's. Uh, he got Alexia's stuff, so I'm going to repaint and double his order on me. Uh, I just I don't know what else to do except for send them again. Um, unfortunately, I can't afford to ship everything UPS, or I would. Uh, but these things are going like two and three day priority. And I'm paying for that. I'm paying for extra shipping for you guys. And they're still losing it. And it's still getting there late. So, uh, doing what we can. But I've got some cool pieces. So, I'm just going to do the handheld for these six this morning. So, two of these are the natural trout. And these are extremely natural. Got a little bit of blue on the bottom. One is in that shallow. A little gold flash and iridescence on top to mimic scales. That pink. Same with this one five double D. This is a medium diver down to ten feet. So fun, fun, fun on this. Love trout. I love doing trout. Also love doing these guys. These greens. Some of my all-time favorite, y'all know that. 
I love them. And the perch. So actually, and you don't know this, and I hope that you do. I hope they show up. Um, but the original ones, I did not do the distressed scaling underneath. I didn't do any mesh. It was just a plain perch. So I'm like, well, shoot, I've got to do it again. I already had mesh out, so I just went ahead and tricked it out for you, Calvin. So enjoy those red perch eyes. And then these. This is the traditional 3-bar P on that baby bull shad. One of these is going to Chicago. One of these is going to Chris Bruce. So that's another thing. Um, performance shirts are going to be pulled off of the website because they are not sending me what is represented. Um, they're sending me like, I guess it's, well, according to my customers, they're sending like a mesh, polyester mesh. And it's not like the active performance wear that they say that they're sending. So we are going to pull that back until we find a visible solution for those. And I'm probably going to be reconfiguring my website completely because things are about to change in my world yet again. And I'm going to be concentrating on some other big stuff going on. And so I'm going to streamlight tailor my website. So I'm going to streamline and tailor the website to the top sales that you guys know and love and ask for the most frequently and uh, pull back on some of the other stuff. So the stuff that you love and order all the time, like the square bills and the S cranks and the jerk baits, like the basics, the meat and potatoes of the website that you guys commonly order off of me is going to remain. And probably the random, like the specialty lines and things like that, that's probably going to be going away within the next 30 days or so. I really need to pull and scale back to concentrate on custom line of this and a few other things happening. So again, I'm going to dedicate a video somewhere down the line. Definitely before the holidays, uh, just got to figure out what all is going to be said and what all I can say uh, contractually. So anyways, that's what I've got for you. Here is over the weekend in uh, Rock -a Hot Campground in Lenexa, Virginia. This is the Bullshad Station. You guys have fun. Thank you so much for hanging out on the channel. Boy, I missed you. Good spray sessions coming. I've got some really good stuff lined up for you guys. Cheers and happy casting from Jekyll Bates. Enjoy the trade show.
you about the you.